This is electrolysis. It's permanent hair removal. It's done with it with a probe, an individual disposable sterile probe for, for every patient. And it's been, it's been around since 1875. Electrolysis was invented. A doctor, a baby had an ingrown eyelash growing in, and he thought if I kill the root, maybe it will help with this because it was going to blind that child. And it's been around ever since then. And um, we, we pre-medicate the area. We take off any makeup, and we use some witch hazel or alcohol. And we stretch the area, and we insert right into the follicle, and remove the hair. And when you're doing the electrolysis, the hair should release. It should not tug. And when we take it out, you can see the root on the end of it. And it is not guesswork. We know what stage of growth it's in. And that's really our job to get you in here when it's still growing because they, they have three specific different root looks. And that was a second stage. A hair has three stages. And you feel a little pinch, but it's not, it's not worse than tweezing it. And we can really move like lightning uh, with, with the electrolysis. So 15 minutes, we can, we can really do a nice clearing. The skin is a little pink when you leave. It, it pretty much cancels ingrowns that tweezing does cause. Tweezings, because you're ripping it by the root, tends to cause some um, hair roots to distort. And, and th then what happens with that is it's not growing out straight, so it gets trapped under the skin. And then when we're done, the we, do a, we always do a cold compress. With the, and the reason we're doing a cold compress is we want all this blood stimulation to leave this area. Electrolysis is permanent hair removal and waxing and tweezing can stimulate neighboring hairs to grow because it's just ripping it by the root and causing blood stimulation. So we're not ripping it by the root, we're severing it and cauterizing the root and so it's, it's not able to make another hair in three or four months when it's time to grow again. And then that's how you leave with the nice smooth glow. And we, we always put a tinted lotion on, a tinted sunblock when you leave so you can uh, go right to the right to your next activity. And you don't have to worry about everyone seeing. We use a mineral mousse. That's one of my favorites. And you can just go right to your activity and you look up.